Okay, so this is Sunday breakfast, second Sunday breakfast for these little monkeys um, from Cortica Ball. First of all, we just wanted to say thank you very much to everybody that's helped us during this difficult lockdown period and those who have donated to us. Um, and also a couple of mentions as well. Um, Bruce S, whose birthday is today. Uh, he's normally with us on his birthday, but unfortunately, for obvious reasons, can't be here. So, uh, happy birthday, Bruce. That's from all of us here. Uh, and also to Mel in Nottingham, who's watching this, uh, again, in lockdown procedure. Um, and she's never seen any of the animals. So, as you can see, she's quite nervous. She's always looking out, because they're total, their only real predators are birds of prey. So, we bring them here. But um, <laughs> she'll be looking out for she'll be looking out for herself and also for Florian as well. There we go. So he's eating his bit. She's looking to see if he's dropped any. And what we're going to do now is I'm going to put the rest of their feed in. We do this three times a day generally. Um, so today they've got red pepper, avocado, kiwi fruit, and chick. They're foraging animals, so it's just a case of putting it in. They'll eat some of it and leave some of it. But I guarantee by, by 5 o'clock this evening, which is time for the next feed, it will all be gone. Okay, so here we have Alessi and we have Kaya. Kaya is Alessi's daughter. Uh, the reason that these two are on their own is because the mother of both Florian and Kaya was killed by a snake when the pups were really young. There were three pups all together. We rescued all, well, we rescued two of them and we left Kaya, which was the biggest pup, in with the dad. Because meerkats can't live alone. So these two are on their own and dad brought up Kaya and he's done a really good job. As you can see, there's lots of holes in this one. They're prolific diggers, they can actually move their whole body weight in about 60 seconds of soil. What I'm going to do, they're waiting for this, so I'm just going to throw this in. And they always sit under the food so they get it all over them. But then they groom each other. that these two are on their own is because the mother of both Florian and Kaya was killed by a snake when the pups were really young. There were three pups all together. We rescued all, well we rescued two of them and we left Kaya which was the biggest pup in with the dad because meerkats can't live alone. So these two are on their own and dad brought up Kaya and he's done a really good job. As you can see there's lots of holes in this one. They're prolific diggers, they can actually move their whole body weight in about 60 seconds of soil. What I'm going to do, they're waiting for this, so I'm just going to throw this in. And they always sit under the food so they get it all over them. But then they groom each other. So that's the end of today's video. Join us tomorrow when we'll continue showing you around and introducing you to the other animals and birds that we have here. Hope you enjoyed this and stay safe and stay home. Thank you.